Here are three steps to create a video like this. Step 1. Generate a story for your video. Head over to ChatGPT and request a story in the genre you want to create, whether it's a kid's, horror, or love story. Let's say you're looking for a kid's story. Create a short story about a pretty girl named Prisha, who spends her nights playing a magical guitar in her room. Once you have the story, ask ChatGPT for prompts to generate images in any AI image generator. For example, you could say, give me a prompt that generates an image for every scene of this story. You can see the result that ChatGPT generated for you. And then step two, voiceover. Go to Eleven Labs and paste the script that ChatGPT generated. Choose a voiceover that suits your story. You can listen to different voiceover options until you find the perfect match. Once you've got your voiceover, move on to step three. Now it's time to generate images for your video. You can use any software to create images. Let's say you want to use Leonardo. First, click on the community feed and choose a theme that fits your story. Download the image that you like and use Pika Labs to generate the images into a video. It's free software. You can either describe Describe your story and generate a video or paste the image that you downloaded for reference. Once you've chosen the images, drag and drop the images into the software and click Generate. If you're satisfied with the result, you can download it. Otherwise, add some more prompts to make it better. You can also change the aspect ratio and frames per second and choose the camera movement of the scene to get the best result. You can even use negative prompts to make your video 2x better. If you're using a reference photo from Leonardo, copy and paste the exact prompt from Leonardo. Try to maintain consistency with the text between 10 to 12 for the best results. You can also upscale the video to get HD quality results. Use the retry option multiple times to get the best results and then use Reprompt to create other scenes of your story with the same theme. The final step is to edit the story. Use any editing software to edit this. After opening your editing software, import all the videos and voiceovers you have created. Arrange the scenes according to your voiceover, add some effects and filters, and generate captions for your video by clicking Auto Captions. Add some cool fonts and colors to make your text pop. Then add some sound effects and music to give life to your video. Also, place a keyframe at the beginning of clips, and then move to the end of the clip and increase the scale a little bit. Now play your video to get an engaging shot. Before exporting the video, select all clips and go to adjust and change the sharpen settings to 30 to get the best quality. Then export it. You can use this method to create animated faceless videos like kids stories, horror stories, or many others and run a successful faceless channel. If you're struggling to grow your faceless channel, then this video is for you.